Hey guys, this is Blender Choxy, and uh, I'm gonna do a tutorial today for texturing a weapon. Uh, uh, however you want to say it, decently or uh, fast and effectively, uh, high quality uh, texturing. Um, so I'm probably just gonna get right to it. But what you want to do is you want to go straight to side view. Uh, we're using the gun that we made last time here. So uh, if I just split the area and get the UV image. To uh, split the area, of course, you just go there, so you've got the two arrows, uh, right-click and click Split Area. And so what I want to do here is open up the uh, image that I used. Okay, uh, so first thing what you want to do, uh, I think I'll start with the body, but you just want to click on it and go into Tab, and you want to select everything, and say Unwrap, and then go to Project From View, okay? And it's important that you do that, mainly because it... Uh, it forms the exact shape of how you're looking at it so um so you know if i were to go say hang on so if i were to go there and do that and then from project view you can see it's got that sort of 3d look to it which is really cool because i can try and get the uh, shape of that like that maybe and then try and texture it that way which would be uh hugely helpful but uh if i was to just go to textured mode here uh, as you can see, it's not the most high quality texture, but uh, it'll do. Right, so I want to make that a little bit longer. I won't try to go perfect, I just want to show you guys the gist of it. So there's part one. Uh, I need to go into a thing here and select this. Uh, a is to deselect and select all. Uh, project from view. Uh, for anyone that couldn't really understand what uh, we were saying in my previous video, I do apologize for that, but um, friends will be friends. We were having a bit of a laugh, so, uh, but yeah, uh, we've been working quite off a lot on Blackout recently, uh, also Dead Season, uh, which is on, uh, videos of Dead Season and Blackout are in fact on my channel if you'd like to check them out, which I doubt you guys would, but um, it is, you can find it on my, um, uh, blah 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 my channel sorry for this random murmur so this is just getting this right um, it's about there there you go that's good enough for me okay I think I'm gonna make this the clip no it can't be the clip because it's not being fed into anything never mind my stupidity uh, there we go perfect mondo uh, so yeah, basically it gets quite repetitive, but it's really easy. If you wanted to be really lazy, you could just select every mesh, uh, press Ctrl and J, and then join them and then do this, but I'm not going to do that, mainly because then I can animate it how I like, and I can add what I like to it. So, uh, but I will show you one outgoing problem with this. Uh, I think I can actually show you it now, we'll, we'll see, we'll see. But the main problem with this is, in fact, um, the fact that you've got this stretched at the top. Uh, I can't really show you it until I've actually finished something from project view. So there we go, I've fixed that. Okay, yeah, here we go. Whoa, hello. I can show you it from here. Da -da 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 -da. Okay, there we go. So as you can see here, see, it's all stretched like so. Uh, if I was to move that down a tad that's better but it's still crap okay yeah but as you can see that's the problem that you have but you can just go over that you can just select them individually but yeah so if I just really quickly get this done it shouldn't take any longer than 15 minutes which is good so da -da 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 -da. It's actually looking okay. Yeah, we was going to use this for Blackout, but we actually can't because of copyright, because a game called Earthrise actually made this. Damn you, Earthrise. It was a good gun. But, yeah, we would use it, but we can't, because uh, we're not thieves. And also, you know... Uh, da -da. Um, please, guys, you, know, you really do need to uh, give suggestions for tutorials. Uh, mainly because we want, uh, instead of me going out and saying, hey, I think I'll do a tutorial on this, I want to be able to sort of go, right, what tutorials have been asked of today? And then actually sit down and start doing tutorials for you guys, just to really bulk out the channel and get more videos. 
because we only have like four videos now uh, this will be five once I've done this but but who cares okay now we're gonna do this which I don't actually know what it's for oh I see I see well where is it there it is mm -hmm. is that part done wait I don't know so there, what's that supposed to be I don't know what that's supposed to be oh well unwrap project from view but yeah this is really all you have to do if you wanted to unwrap it and do it normally then you're stupid because this is really fast and easy to do but like you know you could just go unwrap and then you'd have okay for start unwrap and you'd god damn it hang on right why is it doing this to me unwrap it you'd have just that but if I was to select all and go unwrap from project view it forms the actual shape of the uh, mesh which is actually really helpful what have I done now there we go thought I'd buggered it up oh no but yeah I will be making a dead season weapons update soon and I'll be doing more weapons for my game but um until then, you guys are going to just have to do in my voice, unfortunately. Uh, right. It's almost done. This isn't even a tutorial. It's just me going, oh, life's so boring at the moment. I wish I could party. Instead of making wickedly helpful Blender videos that everyone should thank me for. <laughs> yeah. Forget I said that. Nobody thanks me anyway. <laughs> Uh, if you guys have a problem with anything, just please let me know, and I, I will help. I'm not I'm not that cruel. I may seem it, but don't worry. Uh, Jimmy on, go away. Yeah, I don't really know him. He's just in Maya. Cool. Is that right? Project from view. Yeah, this is taking quite a while. I really can't be bothered. <gasps> Daniel can't be bothered. Oh my god. Yeah, I can always be bothered. Uh, modeling and texturing is my life, and uh, I must do that. Uh, if you guys have scripting tutorials, um, please, I don't know how to script, so if you guys have any, like, how do you do this, I'll go online and find a script, but um, if you're making your own game, I advise that you don't use other people's scripts, because that makes people unhappy, unfortunately. So lining that up there okay we just make that smaller that's cool okay there's that bit uh, but we're almost done uh, next I'm probably just gonna tweak it around a little make it more of a higher standard it actually looks really good so far so uh, damn you Earthrise for making such a good gun but you know they beat me to it thumbs up for singing Whoop. Uh, okay, it goes there, I think. Does it? I don't know. Yes, it does. Sorted. Unwrap. Unwrapping from Project View. Uh, I only found out about it since like a few days ago, which I was really shocked about because it was really helpful. Uh, that has to be bigger for a start. Okay, as bad as it looks, who cares? I don't so here we go you have to make do with that I'm in a rush okay so there's the textured gun fully textured and whatnot now what I gotta try and do is I have to try and go to face select and so no no come on god okay there we go unwrap uh, this is where things get annoying Right, this is just basic. I am sorry for that, but unwrap from project view. <laughs> That's way off. It needs to be at least there. Okay, unwrap from project view. Whoop. You get the idea. <laughs> okay it's not even that for a start it's more view side down if you're gonna do this do it decently unwrap from project view 
Oh my god, it sucks. Who cares? There we go. There we go. It's crap, but who cares? No, it's not. We'll do it proper. Haha! <laughs> no match for me. Oh well, it looks crap, but. Uh, okay, and then let's have a look. Unwrap from Project View. No, unwrap. Here we go. Yeah, different types of unwraps can be quite annoying, but you, you'll get over it. It's oops. Make sure you don't press G. That can be quite annoying too. Okay, and now you're just basically moving that to how you want it to be. So there we go. Uh, that was my really simple tutorial on how to texture a gun fast and effectively. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Uh, please uh, give me some. Uh, Give me some forgot my words and comments on things that you want done like hey i don't know how to do reloading so then i'll just go all right then fine i'll, te I'll teach you how to reload and stuff like that you know uh, i'm a friendly guy i'll be friendly but if i don't know it i will look it up and see if i can help you that way but i hope you guys loved my tutorial and uh, i hope to see you guys whenever as possible thank you goodbye oh wait whoa Daniel Smith, you forgot something. Make sure you go to File, External Data, and go to Pack into Dot Blend File. That way, if you move the picture, then the whole texture won't go pink. So then you just click Save and do that. Happy days. Okay, <laughs> now this is goodbye. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the tutorial. Thank you.